On the 7th of May, Deputy President Cyril Ramaphosa addressed the Rose University community on a range of issues while on a visit to Makana Municipality and pledged his support to the university and economic transformation. In my chairs, I'm coming to this university for the first time. You have a friend in me who will say, Rhodes University should not be closed. There's no reason why Rhodes should be closed. I am for decolonization and have always been for decolonization. We want to change the ownership patterns of our economy. That's what we want to do. During the question and answer session, Ramaphosa was finally asked about the elephant in the room his role and involvement in the Maragana Massacre. Um, give us a response, appealing to your conscience as well, about your role in Maragana. And my conscience is, I participated in trying to stop further deaths from happening. Ten workers had been killed. And my intervention was to say, there is a disaster looming. More workers are being killed and are going to be killed. My role was to try and stop further deaths from happening. Some of the workers had been hacked to death and their eyes gouged out, their hearts ripped out. And that horrified me. And you may say, well, it doesn't really matter, but it did horrify me as a person. And I then said, we need to prevent this from happening. And yes, I may well have used uh, unfortunate language in the messages that I sent out, and for which I have apologized, and for which I do apologize that I did not use appropriate language. But I had never had the intention to have 34 other mine workers killed. With an apology 57 months in the making, Ramaphosa has promised to visit Maritana with Winnie Matikizela Mandela. For Grow Cots Mail, Mashatsi Bambo, Grahamstown.